Hey girls, I'm back with another video. I hope you're all doing incredibly well. In today's video, I'm sharing an H&M Summer 2023 haul. I'm super excited. I'll be trying on all of these items and styling up for you. If you do like this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up and hit the subscribe button if you haven't done so already. I so appreciate that. Of course, everything in this video that I'm sharing and even the items that I don't speak to, they will all be linked down below in the description box. If you're on mobile, simply tap the title of this video and everything will populate for you there. I definitely feel like I ordered a lot of basics for this haul, but I feel like these are items that you can style over and over again for the summer season and obviously transition a lot of these items into the fall season as well, which is so far off. But just wanted to mention that a lot of these are really great basics, good neutrals, pieces that you can wear over and over again. All right, let's get right into it. My H&M summer haul. Now the first item I want to talk through is this simple little wrap dress. I love the soft oat color. I'm really into a kind of like a natural color, more taupe color. I find this color to be super flattering on most skin tones and it's one of my favorite colors to wear throughout pretty much all year long, but definitely the summer season as I have a little bit of a tan and you can pair it back to a lot of great other neutrals like creams and white. Um, accessory shoes, those kind of things, bags. I got a size medium in this dress. I really, really like it. I can't believe that it's only $25. Super, super lightweight material, but I definitely feel like I could have done the large. You'll see in the clips, it feels like a little snug across the back of my um, waist area, like above my butt. So I feel like I could have just sized up and with it being a functional wrap over here, you can definitely adjust that to fit you more snugly in the waist and to provide a better fit. So I definitely feel like I could have just sized up, which is probably true. I'm a little surprised I actually ordered the medium. I feel like in a dress like this, I would, like a mini dress, I would go ahead and size up just because I don't like anything too fitted or too short. But anyways, it's nice that it has a hook and eye closure here too, so you don't feel like your chest is coming out. You do tie it on the inside and then you wrap this extra piece in the front and tie it again. So definitely a great dress. It's not gonna fly open. I feel really good in it. I feel like this dress comes in one other color. If it does, I will leave it, I'll call it out and have it um, linked down below in the description box as well. You'll see in the clip, I styled it back really casually. I threw on those Tory Burch sandals, one of my all time favorite sandals I have probably ever owned. They are so comfortable and they go with so many outfits. They really dress up an outfit. Or in this case, when I'm styling it more casually, I feel like they just look good. So I love those shoes and I believe the color of those are Leche. Um, but I found my I found that they can be styled in so many different ways. And then the bag that I paired with that little wrap dress and the sandals is a striped one from H&M. It's priced right at $40. Definitely a very nicely made bag. Super durable. Of course, I think you have the classic black and white stripes that this will go with pretty much anything you're wearing, whether you're dressing it up kind of how I had or you're truly using it as a little beach tote. This bag is just honestly awesome. It's so well made and I just feel like it goes with everything. You can see on the inside, definitely just like a big amount of space in there and then it has a zipper, which is just really nice, a zipper pocket. So you can kind of keep your keys, wallet, phone, that kind of thing that you need. And I just feel like this is such a great little tote bag for the summer season. And of course you can definitely transition this into the fall as well. Next we have this little jersey skirt and I just absolutely love this. I'm surprised at how much I do love it. It is way more flattering on than I was originally expecting it to be. And I do believe this comes with a matching top. I think it just didn't ship yet. So I'll leave that link down below, but you'll see here that I obviously paired it back to that little strapless crochet top or strapless sweater top. I'll show that in a second. But I'm wearing a size medium in the skirt. I think the ruching here in the front is just really, really flattering. The tie doesn't do anything. It's just there for decorations, but I just think it is really cute. Has a great flow to it. This dress is priced right under $28, and I can see myself styling this in a lot of different ways. Certainly dressed up, I feel like little heeled sandals and a, like a cream crop top or even a black crop top for like a night out. You could definitely style it that way, but I also feel like you can style this in a more casual way too. Pair it back to those Tory Burch sandals that I just shared, or my favorite Steve Madden sandals that I'll share later in the haul. But I feel like that and a simple tank top to go back with this can make it a little more casual, a little more wearable too. So just a really great piece. I Again, I was just kind of shocked. I just never really know with these kind of fabrics if it's gonna hit weird on my butt or hips. That's where I'm more self-conscious on my hips, but I felt like this was really flattering and overall just a really good find. Okay, and then that that little strapless knitted strapless top that I paired back to that skirt 
It's priced at $25. I'm wearing a size small in this. I think it's a really good basic top. I love that it has this notch detail here, kind of giving it a little bit of a more sweetheart kind of shape. I did style this in another way. I paired it back to these gingham pants. I recently shared these over in my Revolve haul, so if you haven't checked that video out, I'll leave it linked down below, but lots of great um, Revolve summer items. I feel like Revolve does summer the absolute best, and I feel like all their pieces there are really trendy but versatile, and I feel like they're always like amazing quality. Anytime I splurge on something from Revolve, I literally wear the heck out of that item or I wear it for like seasons and years to come. So I um, thought this was really cute together. Of course, I styled it back to those Steve Madden sandals. I was just telling you guys, those are such a great neutral pair. They go with everything. I've been styling them a ton. They're priced right at $60. Lots of different color options over on the Steve Madden website too. I will leave that linked down below. But such a good basic top to kind of pair back to lots of different things that you already probably have in your wardrobe. But of course, if you pick some other things up too, just two really good. This is just like a really good basic top. Next is this striped little tank top. It does have an open back, which I love. You just tie it in like a bow there. Um, but I feel like a good striped tank top is just something that I always look for, especially in the summer months. I think it's just like very classic, very summery. I also feel like this you can style throughout multiple seasons. This with a little blazer and jeans for the fall season, same in spring. So just like a really good versatile piece. But I thought this one was really cute with the cutout in the back there. I'm wearing a size small in this and I paired it in just like a very classic summery way I threw on these jean shorts those jean shorts are from Abercrombie they do have my favorite jean shorts with me being a curvier build I love Abercrombie's curve love collection because they have a smaller waist but then they have added length added um, width in the thighs and the hips so you get about an extra inch on each side so in these shorts they are the cutoff short high-rise curve love I'm wearing a size 29.8 Typically in Abercrombie Curve Love denim, I wear either a size 28.6 or a 27.4, but with jean shorts, I always size up at least once. Again, just being a curvier build, I like to be able to easily pull them down if I have to, um, and I like that they're just like a little bit roomier for just wear, like to be comfortable wearing them. But I thought these two pieces together were really cute. You can throw in a claw clip or a ponytail. Converse sneakers, I feel like it's just true summer. It would be a great July 4th outfit or any kind of like get together, casual get together for the summer season. Okay, next we have this little rib tank dress. I am shocked again that this dress is only $25. I'm like, I have two dresses in this haul that are $25. It kind of blows my mind. In this dress, I'm wearing a size medium. You can see it kind of has a slight oversized fit, but I feel like this is the right size for me. Um, I wouldn't want it to be too tight. I feel like it's definitely a more casual dress that you're throwing on with sandals and grabbing a bag more for like a casual evening out or if you're throwing this on over your swimsuit, um, running throughout the day, like maybe do like a little bum bag or a crossbody bag and some sandals, even some white sneakers. So definitely more on the casual side. Of course, you could dress this up if you wanted to do, you could do like a gold belt around your waist and then have like, you know, more of an evening bag or like a nicer bag out for a night out. Um, big earrings, but for me, I definitely see myself styling this in a more casual way like I had here again with the Steve Madden sandals and then this amazing tote bag. I feel like it's just like the perfect summer look, perfect summer vacation outfit look, um, just something that's like really mindless. You just throw it on, throw a couple of your other basics, you know, accessories or shoes, and it's just like a really great summer outfit. I do know this dress comes in several colors, so I'll leave them listed and linked down below. Now I saw these shorts and I thought they were really cute. Obviously in the beige color, I love the gold button details in the front there. I am wearing a size large in these. I knew I would have to size up. And while the fabric is soft and has stretch to it, it's not my absolute favorite. I can't really tell you why. I just don't feel like it does a whole lot for my body or like my curves. So it's not my favorite thing, but I do think how I styled it up was really cute. And uh, the little white tank top that I paired it with is also from H&M. I got a size small in this. I think this top is right under $20. And so I thought the two were really cute. Obviously you can wear it with heeled sandals, even sneakers and like a blazer. Throw a blazer on it if you need some kind of layer for the evening. Um, you can wear this with sandals, but thought it was really cute. And my ponytail for that, I had done a little reel over on my Instagram, like a Barbie inspired ponytail. So I was like, oh, I'm going to keep it for a couple of these clips or whatever like that. Cause I think it's cute and obviously really different from how I normally style my hair. But nonetheless, I thought it was fun. And, uh, yeah, I think it's just kind of cute. 
These shorts are only $18. I'm not sure if I mentioned that. I think the outfit's really cute. I just don't know if it's like my favorite outfit for myself personally, but I do think the outfit's really cute together. And of course, if these are shorts that are very, like you're very interested in, I think you can style these in so many ways. Simple, solid tank tops obviously would be the go-to black cream white and then of course you can even do like little crop tops or like a corset top and heeled sandals so like definitely very versatile i just don't think they are the absolute best pair of shorts for my body and then of course a little white tank top like this i mean so many different ways that you can style this of course i do like that little notch detail in the front again kind of like a little sweetheart neckline the material is really nice just a really great basic top and lastly, we have this little crochet dress. I am wearing a size large in this, obviously very fitted. Has a very low and open back detail and then straps here to just tie it to keep it closed. Like a halter neckline here in the front. This dress is only $33. I think the easiest way to style this would definitely be have like a swimsuit underneath it. With it being a crochet material, you can obviously kind of see through a little bit. I do have my favorite sticky adhesive bra on underneath this. And then for underwear, I kind of just had like this little slip type skirt, but I would really need something even smaller than the length I had. Because you can see a little bit here, which I don't know if it really bothers me. But anyways, I think the easiest to throw it on over a swimsuit. Otherwise, a place where I live, like out here, you could just get away with literally like a thong and like a strapless bra or like sticky adhesive bra. Nobody would even think twice about it. But if you are looking for more of a conservative option, I think you're just gonna have to go with like either petals and the sticky adhesive bra, and then maybe like little boy shorties or even just get like a nude spanked like little mini shorts to wear underneath. But obviously such a great dress for the summer's time. And I think this would be so cute on vacation if you have anything like that planned. This dress can obviously be worn with sandals or wedges or like even little heels, lots of versatility. And then again, I'm wearing a size large and only $33. And then quickly, I want to mention this little gingham top matches the pants that I showed you guys earlier in the video. Um, I just wanted to mention it because I love it. I love the outfit together, but I also love this styled um, separately. This paired back with jean shorts and little sandals or sneakers or little heeled um, sandal. Another really versatile top, but just absolutely loving this. It has a, um, a zipper in the back here, and I'm wearing a size medium. And then when I was on H&M's website, I was looking at t-shirt dresses, kind of like basic t-shirt dresses that could be like a more affordable option than this one from Free People. Um, but I just feel like sometimes the cotton material from H&M isn't the greatest, and sometimes for like the price, I'm like, I would just personally spend the money here. So I just wanted to quickly mention this little t-shirt dress from Free People. It comes in about 10 different colors. I'm wearing a size medium in this. I love the big kind of squared curve back here, and the material is just truly wonderful. It is so soft. Off. it's just it's wonderful and um, this dress like I said comes in so many different colors this dress I think you can totally dress up or wear more casually over a swimsuit or just with like sandals and a crossbody bag and just like have it be super casual but then of course you could dress this up with little heels even throw a blazer on if you wanted to um, but just like have a nice bag and maybe some earrings and you can just definitely dress this up as well so I wanted to quickly mention it this dress is only $50 okay girls so that is it for my H&M summer haul I do hope you enjoyed this video if you did be sure to give it a thumbs up and hit the subscribe button if you haven't done so already I am really trying to reach 10,000 subscribers here would love it and appreciate it if each and every single one of you did hit subscribe if you haven't already done so of course Course, everything is linked down below in the description box leave me a comment if you need anything else at all thank you so much for watching today's video i hope to see you really soon in my next one bye